to the Kent Lab Podcast. All right. So can you help us to understand, because I've heard multiple people have this question for a tiny example um, that we have here in Nashville, which is Dave Ramsey's company. He mm-hmm. has a radio show and then he got into events and now he has different you know, product lines. And I think he's employing, oh man, it's around 800 people, give or take, but he yeah. recently built a new office building. He has a lot of people there. And when you drive by during the day, at least pre COVID, you know, there's just cars everywhere. And like the comment is like, man, how, how does it take that many people, you know, to work at a place where it's mostly air and website? So now you look at Amazon and that question just gets like extrapolated, you know, to the biggest degree possible almost, yeah. which is, how many employees does Amazon have? Because it's a ton. And why does it take so many employees like to have a web-based business, you know, yeah. go, go round? Right, right, right. I think, I, yeah, I think Am- Amazon employees are about around 800,000 right now uh, worldwide. 800,000. Yeah, that's not, uh, and correct me if I'm wrong there, but uh, it's not the contractor. So there's a lot of Amazon contractors and indirect employees. And so if you add those, I think it's like 1.2 or something like that. Dang. So, okay, why does it take 800,000 yeah. people to make a web-based business right. go around? Right, so um, so Amazon is is more than just our, the e-commerce is one of the things you should say. So so one of the biggest chunk of Amazon uh, now is the AWS space. So Amazon Web Services, public cloud infrastructure. So that's a big part of the company. Um, so things like Netflix is all, all of Netflix's data, it's all hosted on, on Amazon servers. AWS. Yeah. Yep. So, so, so Netflix is paying a monthly fee to Amazon, you know, every month to, to rent their servers yes. all over the world. So, so that's really where they're big. Even if their e-commerce flopped somehow, and was overtaken, they would be fine, uh, right? Because they have the they have the biggest part of the market share of public cloud, which is which is the most important thing for like the future of 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 the internet and tech and everything. Yep. So, um, so that's that's a big part of it. And then I think all the little stuff that Amazon has, like just Amazon lockers. So it's like this little thing. Some person had the idea a long time ago. It, it worked. They implemented it. And and again, it, it's all free of charge. You, uh, no customers paying to use these lockers. It's all it's all a um, it's all just a service, a free service. So, the amount of people that I know personally just servicing the lockers, right? All the teams. There's like at least like two, three hundred, four hundred people just doing that stuff. Developers, um, the the support side, like me, like they call us to to fix them. Uh, the field techs, we we um, we have like a, a re- I don't know how much I should say, but <laughs> we we have like I think it's Redbox helps us uh, service the lockers, the field techs. Okay. So all that all that stuff, like every little idea Amazon has, which is a ton, yeah, right. I mean, all these little Amazon Fresh, all these Amazon blank. We all know, we all know them. Yes, uh, we we've tried to look at them for a second or whatever. Uh, those all have giant teams. Sure, and so it's it's really mm. uh, amazing, and I, I wonder if they even think about that when they have these ideas like, oh, this would be really cool. And the amount yes. of personnel it would take to just ha- keep that going is, is unbelievable. Yeah. What do you have there, Andrew? The latest, uh, I Googled how many empl- uh, Amazon employees there are. Um, this is according to Business Insider, um, showing their explosive growth as the tech giant prepares to add 133,000 workers Amid record online sales. This article is from July 2020, so right in the middle of the pandemic. And this little paragraph right here says, these positions, in addition to the 876,000 permanent employees that Amazon employed as of July, could push Amazon's global headcount, including permanent permanent and temporary, up to roughly 1.2 million workers. Dang. There you go. Yeah. That's so many. Can you imagine being the boss for 876,000 people? No, I mean it's. I mean, yeah, that is that's so many. Amazing. I mean, how how many? I wonder how many direct, direct reports Bezos has. I you think it I, might say actually. Yeah, I I might know. I knew that for sure. I can just look it up and see how much he direct has, reports. Like, do you think it's like a couple dozen? Do you think? Yeah, it's not more than that. Yeah. It, okay. It's something like that. Yeah. Uh, Jeff Bezos did confirm that the company directly employs a million. Right. Okay. Right. But like people reporting him, I think it's like, yeah, it's like, like a dozen. Like direct yeah. reports. Yeah. Um, Andrew, can you pull up, because we don't want to get Sam in trouble with insider information. <laughs> can you pull up like, if you pull up like the biggest revenue streams of Amazon, I'm curious, because AWS is one of those kind of, it's one of those, it's one of those revenue streams that 
we don't always think of like yeah, with Amazon. And it's so you know big. what I mean? It, but it's so big, and we yeah. we often think of like I mean I I do because I use the Amazon app way too often. It's like well that's Amazon, you know what I mean? But You're Amazon right. is so yeah. much more than that. I remember I've I've read like reputable articles like on on Forbes, and they're saying like the the new Walmart like. Prime version is going to overtake, and Etsy is going to overtake Amazon, and they're not even talking about AWS. It's like, uh, even, yeah. like what you're not even going to mention that in the article. It's so yes. important. Yeah, it really like, is. Did it, you ever it's see? Crazy. Did you ever see the TV show Silicon Valley? No, but but I, I know the concept. Yeah, okay, yeah. You, yeah, you know the yeah. concept. I mean, there's some there's some um, scenes in there where they're in like these server farms. Yeah, and they're yeah. getting lost down there. Like, and that's AWS, right? Exactly. Yeah, because all these things like Netflix is stored air quotes in the cloud, right? Mm-hmm. And that's a thing. Yeah, but still, everything that's in the cloud is on a physical server somewhere. Yeah, correct. Yeah, right. So so it the, we got to the point where internet is fast. The network, the global network, is fast enough to where compute resources can be hosted somewhere else in the middle of Virginia and then um, it can do the computing power that you're des- you desire right all the physical hardware like RAM and CPU and all that stuff and then and then it can it, it can transmit that over the network to you and mm-hmm. it's fast enough to where that will work uh, so so that's where we're at now and it's going to get to the point where we won't need any any computer hardware at all like like the computers on the desk that won't be a thing you'll just be have a network device and all the computing power, everything will be a subscription, which is gonna, uh, okay. which is gonna suck for us. Because why for Amazon? Well, I think like like companies like Apple, right? Yep. So so it's not gonna be a new Apple computer. It's gonna be a new Apple like device, and yes. then you're gonna subscribe to compute resources that is ho- are hosted somewhere somewhere else. So you think that's where it's going? Yeah, it, it, but yeah. but the only thing that's holding it back is is the, the speed. So once we get is the speed. Well, or isn't. For, it is for okay. that for that something that drastic. Like okay. you doing video editing and all the compute resources are being right. are being funneled That's over the network. Deal. Yeah. This is just like hosting websites and like streaming video and all I that see. kind of stuff. That's possible. Okay. Um, even even video games, they're getting to that point too, where you can stream the the computing power over the network, right? Okay. So mm-hmm. so here you what do you have here, Andrew? Is this where it breaks down? Do you have a yeah. graph there? Invest Investopedia. Okay. Um, the, some key takeaways is that Amazon makes money most of its money through its retail subscriptions and web services, similar to retail, what Sam was saying. Retail subscription and AWS, the, sure. Yep. Mm-hmm. Retail yep. remains their primary source of revenue, with online and physical stores accounting for the biggest share. Um, their North American segment was the fastest growing out of all of its segments for the second quarter, 2020. Can you scroll up to there was a chart there? I thought I saw. Right here. Okay. Okay. But that's North America International and AWS. Oh, dang. Mm-hmm. Look at that. So North America, revenue from North America, Amazon 62%. International revenue, 26%. And AWS is 12%. <laughs> but then look at operating, operating income. income. Operating. Oh, crap. Look at yeah. that. Yeah. 58%. Of their operating income, though, AWS accounts for 58%. Yeah. So essentially, you could look at that as like net profits, net operating profits, maybe. Because yeah. I think when it's saying income there, it's talking about profits, not gross revenue. Look how profitable AWS is. 58% of Amazon's operating income is AWS. Right. 36% is from everything in North America, and only 6% is international. So the North America operations are more profitable than international operations, and AWS income is way more profitable yeah. than anything they have going on. That is... And then the market, when you look at the market share of public cloud, so the other the other two big ones... Are are Google's pl- public cloud? Inf- um, what do they call it? Uh, I think it's GCP. Uh, and then and there's Azure, Microsoft Azure. Mm. And so these are the public cloud infrastructures, which are which are most one of the most expensive things to do in the world right now. And then they don't even have a a, a sli- the, the, the amount. It's like eighty percent market share of, of public cloud is is Amazon. So they aren't even close. Eighty yeah. percent. It's something of the like public that, yeah. market share is Amazon. Yeah, like, like for, for, uh, for like cloud based services of cloud based services. So like like a majority of websites. Golly. Nowadays are probably hosted on Amazon servers. Yeah, that is like I total domination. Yeah, yeah, it's amazing. Yeah, do, are, do we expect Amazon? So I know Google is getting beat up right now by who? Who's beating them up in uh, in in government? Um, who's over these things? It's basically like antitrust. Yeah, like the saying um, they're a monopoly or FCC? whatever. It's not that. It's um, I just heard it today. Yeah, they're doing a hearing tomorrow about that. Yeah, like yeah. that's like a senator hearing or something like that, right? Um, whatever it is, like the Senate, Senate Oversight Co- Committee, yeah, one or something of the, one like of the committees, that. yeah. So, is Amazon? Do we know that if Amazon's getting beat up? Because I did mention it in the article I read. It was just referring to Google. Yeah, I think I think they're they're doing Amazon's doing a lot of censoring on their like uh, streaming platforms too. Because okay. obviously, 
they don't run like a search engine. So Google's always brought up because the search results and things like that. And then mm-hmm. Facebook's brought up because of the social media. So like all the, all the interactions is happening. So Amazon's platforms are, are, are not like that so much. Mm-hmm. But so, um, what, uh, well, just on Amazon there, I was going to ask you one more thing yeah. about that. Um, are you working out of the headquarters that they're going to build downtown? Because that's not built yet, right? No, I think it's like halfway done or something will like that. Will you work yeah. out of there? I, I will, yeah. Okay. They, they just pushed it back to June um, up of working remotely. So I, okay. s- I have not ever been there. So you're working from your house yeah, right now. Yeah. I see. All right. Fascinating. <laughs>